Hey kids, it's time for another episode of Kitty Cat Gaming with your host, Mortimer! KKG! KKG! Yay! <laughs> hey YouTube, it's Mortimer and welcome to a new episode of Kitty Cat Gaming with a new game. Uh, this is a game that I've gotten a couple of requests for. It's called Cute Demon Crashers, and it is a dating sim game where there's three guys and one girl that you can date. And uh, I've been hearing a lot of uh, a lot of good things about this game. I guess it is. I, I mean, I'm sure you guys can assume it is a hentai dating game. Uh, but the thing about this game that's different is that. Uh, it's all about uh, giving permission and uh, trusting your partners and I guess you can, you know, stop things in the middle of sex or at any time. Uh, it's just all about, you know, teaching people the right way to do things, I guess. So I'm pretty excited to play this. Uh, let's start a new game. I've never played this before, so I don't know what to expect. It looks like it's your first time playing Cute Demon Crashers. Would you like to see some tips on how to play? Click or enter to continue. Let's let's see, because I want to know how to play. To advance to the game, left click or press the space or enter keys. When on a menu, left click to make a choice or use the arrow keys to select a choice and enter to activate it. Okay, that's pretty simple. Uh, blah, blah, blah. You can choose open dyslexic. A dyslexic friendly font from options as well. What? That's pretty fucking cool. I didn't even know that was a thing. Oh, we gotta turn off the 18 plus filter. Yeah. Well, I mean, it saves me from editing, or rather Kevin, so maybe I should leave it on. Uh. All right, all right. Oh, and that's how you can stop, like in the middle of sex or something. During intimate scenes, you'll have to be presented with choices that will let you agree, choose an alternative scene, choose to reciprocate or stop the session. You can also click the stop button in the right corner when it's available to stop the session. Don't be afraid of stopping. The character will appreciate your honesty. It's pretty fucking rad. Uh, okay, find all your previous pictures, replay scenes. All right, we get it. This is pretty straightforward. Uh, whoa, no, my name, not Claire. Let's see. Morty! Heartthrob. I feel a pleasant shudder throughout my body as I continue to stroke myself. Oh my god! Mm -hmm. The phone on my nightstand vibrates, ruining the moment. I let out a groan, but I roll over anyways, using my clean hand. <laughs> I grab the device and read the display. I'm having an awesome time with my boyfriend. We just arrived in Mexico. So romantic. Oh my god, Jelly! Well, I'm going to a party this weekend and I'm gonna snag myself a hottie. Guess who's celebrating their two-week anniversary with their girlfriend? This one! Wow, so many texts from so many friends. Usually I'd be happy for them, but for some reason reading the friend chat is depressing. I suddenly back on the bed, pushing away the trashy romance book I was reading earlier. It falls over, landing next to a few other books, my handheld device, and maybe a few forgotten plates and cups. It's spring break and here I am alone. I don't think I've ever been outside since it started. My parents are on their yearly honeymoon and my little brother is away at baseball camp. All I have are my textbooks and, well, my right hand. I close my eyes, no longer in the mood. It would be nice just to have a little romantic fling. I could help with that! Oh man, that, that little record clip was a little bit too soon. Man, I'm gonna like spit out my gum cause like, it's making me drool and it's hard to talk. Sorry guys. What? Wow, she is freaking cute. It looks like something Star Exorcist would draw. What? I jolt upward, causing the speaker to jump back. I guess that's a no? More like, what are you doing here in my house? How did you even... Whoa, oh my gosh. Okay, if I had to pick a favorite right now, it's the guy with the red hair. He's got tattoos. Pretty fucking cool. What's going on? Huh? Huh? What is going on? Oh dear. oh dear, Miari, you didn't. Excuse me, oh my god, I'm disgusting today. I'm sorry guys, I just burped. I I was going to explain in a bit, you guys arrived too fast. How? How could we, when, god, the voice acting, just one word is kind of weird. How could we not when you conjured a portal right in the hallway? Uh, uh miss, we mean you no harm. There already seems to be a misunderstanding on our part, and I apologize for the confusion. Um... 
He takes a step closer and I pull the sheets up to my chest. The bottom is snagged under the mattress, causing it to slip under my feelings, revealing my front. Hey! I like your panda shirt! <laughs> he's so cute! I like him. Oh, but I like this guy too. He's all like... <laughs> oh, thanks! I got it at... Uh, hey, don't change the subject! I'm lowering my guard! Right. Right, I think I would be terrified too if four strangers suddenly appeared in my house. Out! Without even an explanation? Ugh, fine. Out into the hallway then. Please let me change first. What the hell was that? They just appeared out of nowhere. I want to listen to the door. I approach the door and hold my ear close to the frame. They're not even trying to lower their voices, making it easy to catch every word. We completely scared that poor girl, Miari. Uh, Kale's mad. Kale, he's never mad. This is why it's important to plan in advance. I know, I'm sorry. I just took action without really thinking. I only wanted to help her. I feel awful now. Should we try talking to her once? She calms down, we can at least apologize. It truly does sound like there's a misunderstanding going on. Maybe they aren't that bad? I can't believe I'm doing this, but I'll talk to them. Maybe there's a logical explanation behind all of this. Hold on. Let me make sure that that hentai stuff was on. That was here. AJ Fielder. On. Okay. Sorry, sorry. I can't believe I'm doing this, but I'll talk to them. Maybe there's a logical explanation behind all of this. Yeah, right. Have you calmed yourself down? As calm as I can be after having four strangers break into my bedroom with horns and very revealing clothing. Are you cosplayers? Cos cosplayers? Players? And we won't be strangers anymore if we give you our names. I agree. Oh dang. I agree. We should properly introduce ourselves. Kale. I'm Kale. I apologize for the commotion earlier. My friend here can be a little, uh, impulsive. I'm Marari. <laughs> I guess I did jump a little too soon. I'm Mirari, but Mira is okay too. Aki. Aki. Sorry about surprising you earlier. I guess we were all a little surprised. His name's Aki? He's not Aki. Orius. Orius. Pleased to make your acquaintance. And you are Morty. And please tell me why you're here. <laughs> you don't recognize us? We're Incubi. Okay, I don't even know what that means. <clears throat> and one succubus. Okay, so they're just demons? Sex demons. Oh, even better. Oh my god, my fun times didn't attract you or something, did it? I admit how you got into the house baffles me, but I don't believe. I glance past them to see a giant swirling purple vortex hovering in the hallway. Okay, I'm convinced. It's a dream. You want anything bad? You won't do anything bad to me. Whoa! Whoa, whoa, we never think of anything like that. You can rest easy. We're here to help you. Help? <laughs> you were feeling lonely, right? And you were fantasizing about having a fling. Hmm. You were right about calling us demons, though. We feed off sexual pleasure from humans. <laughs> so it's a win-win situation. You get to have a good time, and we get nourished. But but I don't even know you. I can't I can't just accept an offer like that without the blue. Oh. Purple portal. Or that. Um. But she does bring up a good point. Um. Not every human feels comfortable copulating with a stranger. It needs to be a positive experience for her to obtain this win-win situation, as Mirari puts it. Um. So what do we do now? Uh, I kind of conjured the multi-being portal, and it took a lot of effort. It has to run its course anyways. It won't vanish until a few days have gone by. I know. We can stay here for a little while until you feel comfortable experimenting with any of us. No pressure. If you still don't trust us, we can leave. I promise we won't pressure you to do anything while we're here. Um. Does that sound acceptable? Um, as acceptable as having four sex demons hanging around my house is, I guess. My mind all is all jumbled. If it's a dream, it'll be easier to go along with it. And once I wake up, poof. I'll know this never happened. Thank you. Thank you. I promise you won't regret it, Morty. <laughs> Don't worry. We'll go easy on you since you're a virgin. Whoa, how does he know? <laughs> if anything, you'll have to go easy on him. He's inexperienced, too. Ah, oh, he's so cute. Whoa. What? You don't just tell people that. Virgin Incubus, yeep. Gotta be a dream. <sighs> now that's settled. Ah, uh, I haven't been to the human realm in a while. I think I'll take a walk outside. Ah, uh, but... I guess she'll be okay. It's a dream after all. I hate to impose. I hate to impose it. May I ask where the kitchen is? Uh, that Thank way. You. Thank you. Great. I'm starving. <laughs> I think I'll brew a nice cup of tea too. Hey. Hey, I found the video games. Wow, check out this collection. Aki is totally our guy. Aki. Don't raid her house. <sighs> be sure to return everything to its proper place. I'm going back to bed. No more romance novels for a long while.
It's still here! <laughs> Hesitantly, I pick up a dirty, discarded sock and toss it into the purple portal. It vanishes into the void. <laughs> I must be still be tired. I should eat. I hope there's cereal left. Something smells good. But why? <laughs> well, I am thoroughly enjoying this game so far. I hope you guys are too. Um, I'm really excited to see what happens when we start copulating with the Incubi. Um, <laughs> but uh, leave me a comment down below. Let me know which person you would like to see us try and interact with first. Um, I'm kind of feeling all of them. Uh, be sure to hit that subscribe button if you are not subscribed so you guys don't miss the next video. And I'll see you guys all then. Bye, everybody!